The blowing bubble tradition. I have to tell you what Jimmy the Baker has done with these loaves. I have never seen in process in my life. So please stay tuned to see. I know we call this the cinnamon loaves sampler, but I'm going to rename it the cinnamon lovers sampler. I like that very good. Because you're getting at least two loaves of his cinnamon treats. And then you get to choose, do you want two more of those for a total of four pounds of loaves? Or would you like to have two of his raisin with the cinnamon, two of the chocolate with the cinnamon, or two of the new raspberry with the cinnamon? All for under $38. Sell price for Christmas in July is $37.80. An easy payment here of $7.56 and then free shipping and handling. And then your choice of delivery date. So either November 4th, or December 2nd, and auto delivery here, Jimmy, is available, and I know how much you do by hand. Yes. This has got to be quite the undertaking. With auto delivery, you're going to get a new foursome every 90 days for a year, and good news, you keep the price, you keep the easy payment, you keep the free shipping and handling. So, Jimmy, you were on Wall Street and yes. decided to become a baker. Well, what more or less, Wall Street decided I should become a baker. Okay. I couldn't pick a stock with tomorrow's newspaper, so that was a problem, um, especially for my clients. Uh -huh. Anyway, I fell, I've, I've always loved to create, and I was fortunate enough to meet an eighth-generation baker who took oh. me under his wing and taught me all that he knew. What you're looking at is brioche. This is the art of dough. And you are, with me, what you'll learn is that it's as much recipe as it is process. Mm -hmm. You can have a great recipe, but if you have a lousy process, not going to work. It doesn't, doesn't you can have a mediocre sense. recipe, but if you got a great process, you could make up for a mediocre recipe, by the way. But anyway. It's all exceptional with you, is it not? You. Yes. Is so, it not? So the way this bread is made is we make the dough. Just like the cinnamon roll, you'll hear me say the star of the show is the dough. And the dough, which is a brioche, which is mean it's more buttery, it has more egg in it than the cinnamon roll does. And what the part of the process that really matters okay. is how... We bake this. We just, unlike white pan bread, uh -huh. we braid this. And there's a reason for that. If you see the way the swirls of the bread cut nice and nicely, that's because of the braid and the twisting, which we must do by hand, by the way. So we'll get into the flavors in a moment, but, this, but the other part of this process, which everybody loves, which you, have, which you haven't Courtney, seen before. Courtney Kaysen, I need you to check this out. Do you see what's say, about to happen here? I see what's about to happen. I think I'm suffering from a little TMJ from that bubble gum challenge, but I'm here and I'm ready for the butter. Okay. So there's a lot of butter. I had a dilemma. <laughs> I had a dilemma. I wanted to get really nice butter notes in the dough. Now there is butter is baked in as well as shortening, but when I sliced this, I didn't taste butter or enough of it. So I first took a pastry brush and I brushed the top. Still not good enough. And then. An old time it taught me a trick, an old German trick, and that is to simply roll the bread, slightly submerge it in the butter. Now, would we call that a butter bath? Yes, you just might call it a butter bath. <laughs> okay. It's not something that one might take on the weekend if they were home alone with nobody watching. Right, it watching. would just be like a That's, quick bath. Yeah, yeah something yeah. like that, sure. okay? But anyway, so once the butter has soaked into the bread a little bit, then we're going to come over here and we're going to roll it in the cinnamon sugar. Cinnamon. Sugar. And Dear there's a reason Lord. for that besides the fact that it looks really great is <laughs> yes. is this is very much oh this is very much a heat and serve bread. You could so eat this good. by the slice. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> oh, and Jimmy, you're not doing that just for the sake of television. That's what happens with all of these loaves. We make I'm happy to say since debuting this on QVC, we're selling these by the thousand. And um, I have the greatest staff on earth. They, each one of these breads come out of the oven and are pulled out of the pans and done just what you saw. Go Would ahead. Would you come here and tell me about these though, Jimmy, because your choices, and I want to be clear on this, you could get four of the cinnamon Correct. that you just saw, that cinnamon, the sugar, the butter, and if you want nothing but that, and that sounds great to you, we have that option. But if you want to mix it up and get two of the cinnamon, but then get two of any of these, we can help you out with that. We have the raisin choice, the chocolate choice, and then that new raspberry. So please tell me about these, if you would, Jimmy. Okay, the dough is all the same throughout. It's different fillings and slightly different processes. What you're seeing on the end there is the raspberry, yeah. which seems to be the runaway, runaway favorite. That is, I'm gonna call that a dessert bread. It's not so much a slicing, toasting bread. It's at the end of a meal or, or, or in the morning if you want something sweet. 
This is an excellent, this is out of all four of these breads, this is the one you definitively want to put in the microwave for about 15 or 20 seconds. Next up is the chocolate swirl. After that is the ray, what you're, what you're seeing right there. Yeah. After that is the raisin. And after that is just the plain cinnamon. So I want to zap one real quick for you. So what do you, how long do you put it in the microwave? I, unlike the cinnamon roll, which is 30 seconds, yes. I just want you to warm this up enough to bring out the butter notes and, and bring out kind of a tender, I don't want it to be fall apart hot. So. How do you serve this at the holidays then, Jimmy? If you're thinking about like family and friends coming over, you would serve it as dessert? I would, well, you know breakfast? what? This is, a, it's, on the, it's on the kitchen table oh. and it's being sliced, oh especially in the morning, by the way, the cinnamon and the, while you're biting into that. I cannot wait to enjoy this and it's just warm enough. And we did wrestle with the recipe. We want this to stand up to the microwave, so we use a slightly higher protein flour. Mm -hmm. So when it goes in there, it doesn't completely oh break my down. Gosh. My and, goodness. Right? And each one of these loaves, it kind of reminds me of the uniqueness of a snowflake. Like how there's not one that's the same. It's not. Your artisans, when, it's when they're, very, they're twisting very, the dough. That like, is very, very true. I'm really touched by that because. I mean, I'm looking each, at the, the front of each one of these and they're magnificent. Because each one is twisted. Each one comes off the line. The mm -hmm. workers are shaping the dough. The cinnamon in particular and the cinnamon mm. raisin are the best My of gosh. the four, the best slicing breads. So I would, by the way, use either the cinnamon or the raisin for the morning French toast. And by the way, this is Christmas in July. We have to talk about gifts. Yes, this is, I like to bake memorable events. When you give a gift to somebody like this, it's like now. I'm flattered when people call me and say I need cinnamon rolls for Christmas because it's a tradition. Right. And it's been seven years on QVC. This is a gift. Someone's going to remember this next year and when you give this to them. Yet it was less than $10 right. for something that is gourmet, that is memorable. That says, wow, did you find, a, is there a new spot in town or you know, where did you stumble into this bread? I mean, it's just, it's a beautiful process. The ingredients, there's no compromise with anything with Jimmy. We know that is true. And here you're getting four one pound loaves for $37.80. I think it's one of the best values in the show. Thank like you. For what you're getting for the price and then the way that it's made. The amount of work that goes into it. It's, 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 of all the things we make, this is the most handwork that we do as scratch bakers. Just amazing. So choices again, you could get four of the cinnamon. That might be what I do, Jimmy. I just love the cinnamon, cinnamon so much. But then I also haven't tried these, so maybe I should sample and then decide. <laughs> we have, so four cinnamon or two cinnamon and two raspberry, two cinnamon and two chocolate, two cinnamon and two raisin. So that's the way it works. And then auto delivery, let me explain that, because you could get another four loaves every 90 days for a year. Bless Since your heart. it's not a seasonal item, um, keep it coming because the price carries over with those future shipments. So does the five easy payments as part of our flash easy pay event and then free shipping and handling. You get that with every shipment as well. And let's say you've got something coming up and you want an order faster than 90 days from now. No worries. We can send it out to you then. You just let us know what you prefer. What's this one, Jimmy? That's, that's, that's raspberry. That's me. the raspberry. My goodness. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That is so warm. I might. Oop, so I will cool. tell you, I will tell you what David <laughs> Venable said. It yeah. tastes like a hot jelly donut. A oh my gosh. Really well made jelly donut. <laughs> I got to cool it down. Oh my gosh. I got a little bit of and that again, raspberry flavor. I mean, only about 15 mm. seconds is all you need and serve oh it warm. Gosh. And you don't have to, by the way, because you could slice it and eat it cold. And By how the long way, does it stay fresh? It'll stay fresh for at least five to seven days in its wrapper, but I advise put it right in the freezer when you get it. Okay. Then it'll last as long. It thaws in a matter of minutes, and it'll be great on your holiday table. Oh. I promise you that. If, if we know you're not going to be disappointed. Right. You know, that's it's a bold statement, because I know people can be particular about food and flavors, mm -hmm. and I just feel so strongly that you're going to get these home and be tickled. Or those you give it to are going to be wowed by what you've done. And yet, it's under $10 per one pound loaf in this sampler. It's M63478. Easy pay, free shipping and handling. You, yeah, yeah, you can, Jimmy. Jimmy, I don't want to say he tried to cheat, but he tried to cheat twice. No, it's, it happened twice, but I appreciate Thanks the spirit. Thanks to the woman, too. <laughs>